It is Tanya Atomic and this is 31 Days of Horror. This is day 13. We watched Tenebrae by uh, Dario Argento. And this is an Italian giallo film, which which really was a mystery. I know some giallo films are like crime uh, mysteries and this really was one. And uh, it's about a author who wrote a book called Tenebrae, which um, he and he's also being um, stalked by someone who is murdering people and sending him um, notes. And um, at first it seems really cut and dry, but um, there's little things that happen too, and you're not sure how they tie into the story. And um, what I liked about this is it had a lot of twists. It was like, what do you think is going on? Oh, this other thing is also going on. But it wasn't like... Oh, we are pretending like this one thing's happening and then, whoops, tricked ya. It wasn't like that, which I think is kind of like a cheap, like, um, bait and switch to the audience kind of thing. It wasn't like that. It was like something's going on and then something else is also going on. And um, there, there were, you know, a lot of characters. Some characters were trying to solve the mystery. Some characters were involved with the different characters, with the different main characters. And you're we're trying to figure out how the whole time. And I think by the time you get to the end, it's like, that happened too? Well, this happened too? And that person did what? And But it all makes sense, though, at the end. That's the thing that is good about it, is it, it does all make sense when it um, comes together at the end. N not saying there's not plot holes um, in the way that things may work. Um, you know, like police allowing pe and just any old people to walk into a crime scene and stuff like that. I mean, I don't know. Like, was this the 70s? Did that happen? I don't know. Um, <laughs> I don't think so, but maybe. Um, but yeah, there were little plot holes like that. But this fact, the main story, um, it did make sense what was all going on. So um, I enjoyed it. Recommend it to anyone that enjoys Giallo or Dario Argento. Um, yeah, that was one that we enjoyed. We're going back to the um, pack, the 50 pack, starting tonight. So stay tuned.